Right, guys. This Valent Boiler, the exclusive 843, has been the bane of my life for about three years. I didn't fit it. Um, I've come out and serviced it three years in a row. And each year, I've struggled with the CO levels, the emissions. I've had Valent out three times in three years, each time they've changed the CO sensor. This last time, I finally got to the bottom of what I was doing wrong. Although there was issues with the boiler, I was still doing something slightly wrong. As you can see, I put it into service mode here. I put it into minimum. Just put it in like you would normally do on the, the old Ecotech Pros. It's in minimum, but you can see that it's not actually in minimum. And there's an S93 on the right hand side. That S93 means it's in calibration mode. And every time you put it into service mode, whether it's minimum or maximum, when the S93 is showing, which will be every time, it is in calibration mode. And you have to wait seven or eight minutes for it to come out of calibration mode. There, I think it's ready. But it's not. This is where I was going wrong. So, on this occasion, I'm actually doing it wrong. So I'm just going to show you what not to do. I've looked on that screen and I saw the flame picture drop to, to the lowest. So I presumed it must be in minimum but it's still showing S93. So this is still in calibration mode. And that's why these readings are a little bit unusual. You've got quite a high CO2 for a valent boiler. And look, you're getting high CO, then you're getting low again. According to Valent, do not put your analyzer in why it is showing S93. If you're doing the service mode in heating mode, you must wait for S04. If you're doing it in hot water mode, we've got a hot tap running fast, you wait for S14. I've not got a hot tap on, so I should have been waiting for S04. But in a minute, you will actually see the readings go off the scale. So the readings have sort of stabilised, and you would think they're just they're just not they're just out. And maybe you would just write them down and and then get on your way and think, well, they're not great. They're not. They don't seem as they should. But if you'd waited long enough, then this would have happened. You're getting readings in the thousands. Again, this is, according to Valent, it's in calibration mode. You shouldn't have put your analyzer in. It's difficult to see on the screen now, but it is actually on S04 now. But this is the problem. It is on S04, so according to Valen, it is now in minimum mode. 
and this is the time to put your analyzer in. But as you can see from the flame picture on the screen, it isn't on minimum. So I put my analyzer in. And the readings, as, you, as you'll see, are still not correct. So after this little section of video was taken, Valent came out that week and they changed the CO sensor. This, was the, this is the third CO sensor since the boiler was new and it's a three year old boiler and an extremely expensive boiler. So this, this, this is the correct reading on the day now. I'm, 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 I'm measuring the emissions correctly. It's showing S04 on the screen, which is correct. Although, as you see on the left, the flame picture isn't on minimum. And that's probably why Valent changed the CO sensor again, because there's definitely an issue. It, it wasn't me so just for the video that's on minimum now but for some reason on there it's not actually on minimum it says minimum but that indicates that it's not on quite minimum it's sort of it's up from minimum yeah i've just already said that so i'm sorry for repeating myself right Valent have been out, they've replaced the CO sensor, they've left me a nice little bit of information there informing me that I must wait for the S4 or the S14 before putting probe into the, into the emissions test point. So this is the week after, I've come back, I've spoke to them on the phone, they've left me the message there, I know what I'm doing. I need to put it in, well, I'm going to put it into maximum mode now. Um, usual way, code 17. Into the check. Well, test programs, check programs. We want P01, maximum load. So again, even though Valent had been out a few days before, calibrated it, calibrated the gas, the CO sensor and gas valve, and replaced the CO sensor. Now I'm putting it into maximum load. It has to recalibrate all again. So S93, it's calibrating again. This again is going to take seven or eight minutes which is crazy because I've got to heat the whole house again. I've got to burn a load of gas and I've just got to wait and wait and potentially overheat the system before I even get a reading. On this particular boiler, it, it hasn't helped. I've not fitted this boiler. It's an oversized boiler for this particular house. It's a big 43 kilowatt combi boiler and them radiators are going to get really really hot before we even get to the S04 and we can get a reading you could do the hot tap but the hot water tap the pressure of the water isn't even that high in, in the house so again, you'd just be wasting so much water. I'd have the water police after me. Again, it would just overheat anyway. So on this particular system, you know, it's, there's quite a few radiators in the house. It's a decent sized house. Hopefully we can get to S04 and get our maximum reading. So the S93 is still there, still can't take a reading. If I put my analyzer in, the reading is just going to be all over the place and then potentially 
get the surge of CO as well that, that I did before on the minimum and I get, you know, I poison my analyzer. So we've just got to wait, we've just got to wait and wait. Temperature's going pretty high. As you can see, the flame picture was up high then, now it's back down low as it's calibrating the gas valve. So this is an automated process, obviously quite an advanced boiler and it just does all the calibration itself. So we're still showing S93. Right, S04. How long's that taken to get that? Now the boiler is going to go into 42 kilowatt of power. I haven't got long to get a reading before it just kicks off. So analyzer in. Am I going to get a reading? S04, that's what we want, that's what we've been told is the time to take a reading and it's kicked off, it's overheated and kicked off. Right, I had to come back another day again and I finally got it in time and got a couple of readings. So that's my maximum reading, 8.866 and I got a minimum, um, was the minimum? which was 8.65 and they were acceptable readings and I filled my service book out, repressurized the expansion vessel, did my other checks and I just hope when I come again next year it's not going to be the same problem. Thanks for watching.